I added this steel chain. It's a steel professional yellow. And I don't know, it's a great chain. I've only had to sharpen it a couple times. I got these felling dogs off of Amazon. They were super cheap, I think like $7. And they bent. Actually, they bent the first time they even looked at a piece of wood. I was actually surprised. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to trace these out onto a piece of paper and I'm gonna make some new ones. As you see there, I traced them out. I actually made a little bit better design. Got my template made and there they are, instant felling dogs. I made a second set for a friend's saw, it has the same thing. There you go, you can see they're installed. I got them sprayed with some WD-40, that's all I wanted. You can see my redneck drilled muffler. It serves the purpose, it does what it needs to. Also drilled out the back plate on uh, opened up the intake. You can see the filter through the holes there. I don't know, works pretty good. And I have an 18 inch bar on here. There's the chain I got sharpened up, it's a Husqvarna bar. And I cut down this giant oak tree. I don't advise it. This was definitely a sketchy cut, and I wish my GoPro would have worked for this one. I probably won't cut a tree this size again with that saw, but I don't know. Here, I'll show you how it was running. It wasn't running very good. Second time I saw done that to me. Time for a new bar, new chain. You can see right here, as soon as it hits that stick underneath, it just sends the chain flying. When I was doing some inspection, I found some wood wedged in the bar. And I don't know if that had anything to do with it, but I already have a new bar and chain ordered and it'll be here shortly. So I got inspired and decided to make myself a muffler. Had some grill parts laying around that I really didn't need anymore. Cut them up, welded them up, and that's what I got. Used a quarter inch plate for the base of the muffler. Painted it with some high temp paint. Welded it with my Lincoln. There you can see a difference. I gutted out muffler versus this. <laughs> I'm actually quite pleased with this chainsaw. If you ever see one at a yard sale, needs fuel lines or whatnot, snatch it up. You can see with a sharp chain, it throws down some good chips. Running way too big a bar on it right now, but you know, hey, whatever. And it's a fun saw to experiment with. I made a muffler. Never made a muffler before. Just to see what it will do. It's a good trial and error saw. And hey, if I blow it up, it'll only cost about $50 to rebuild with parts from eBay. But here's another one, and like always, Thanks for watching.